Welcome to the Idea Booster, where employees seek an opportunity to advance their ideas with monetary assistance. Who are these boosters? They're self-made experts who serve as top managers for the city of Olathe. Susan Sherman is the assistant city manager, a position she's held for nearly 25 years. From engineer to manager, for four years, Mary Yeager has led her department as director of public works. And for nearly two decades, Michael Wilkes has held the reins as Olathe's city manager. First into the booster, a solution for those in need of tools. Hello, I'm Vanessa Von West. I work in the communications and customer services area. Today, I'm here seeking $10,000 for a community tool lending library. Here's a little bit more information. Thanks for coming. Boosters, do you know of someone with a project at their home that's maybe in need of repair or a fix that just doesn't seem to get done? My neighbors, they drive me nuts. Well, for many, fixing the repair is the easy part. It's finding the right tool where the struggle comes in. Have any of you ever looked around your home and found that you haven't had the right tools? That's me. I never have the right tools, and I'm always trying to find a neighbor or friend or somebody that's got what I need. Well, say goodbye to searching for friends or neighbors who may have the tools you need, and say hello to the Olathe Tool Lending Program. Lending, isn't that the same as asking a friend? Yes, only better. Unlike with your friend, you'd be ensured that your tools are clean and in working condition. It would operate out of the Olathe Library, just like if you were to check out a library book. So if you needed a level or a saw or a hammer or even a leaf blower, you'd simply check it out, use it at home, and then bring it back for the next customer. It sounds great and easy enough, but I have to know, Vanessa, I think this came in as a submission to our sandbox. How does it now qualify as a booster idea? I'm so glad you asked. This program was submitted via the sandbox and now via the booster, we'll hopefully get a chance to test it out. To start out, it's going to cost about $10,000 to purchase a lot of the tools to lend out. Vanessa, help me out here. You mentioned some of the tools you were talking about, most of which are in the you know, $50 to $100 and $125 range, so why do you need $10,000? You're right. There are several low-cost tools that will be part of the lending library. But we're a big city, and we have a lot of tools to lend. We'll probably have to buy multiple hammers and other things, but we also want to be able to lend larger tools, like chainsaws and other things that could be a little costly for someone to purchase on their own. So someone checks out a sander and takes it home. What's stopping them from not bringing it back? Rest assured, there will be a process. Just like checking out a library book, your information will be held on file, and you'll be accountable for what you check out. Well, I'm still worried people will check it out and they'll never bring it back. Because of that, I'm out. I understand your hesitation. I get it. Well, I'm not worried about stealing. I'm worried about having the staff available to handle the tools and for all of the people who are gonna flock to this great program. This program will not be a burden on staff. It'll work just like checking out a library book. Only these tools might weigh a little bit more. You know, I like the idea. I just don't think it's worth 10,000 bucks. So I'm out. Well, I think this sounds like a great idea and really will benefit our community. I believe in the program and I want to make a deal with you. I would love to work with you. You have a deal. Let's do this. Thanks for coming in, Vanessa. I'm really glad I brought this program to the Idea Booster. It's an awesome opportunity to pilot it and hopefully it'll be a chance for other programs to get pilots in the future. I can't believe you two bowed out. This is going to be a great project and it's really going to help out our community. Well, now that you say it like that, it does sound like a great idea. Even though I thought it was too expensive, it is a good idea. I guess that's why they call us the Idea, idea Boosters. Boosters.